Hey guys, welcome back. It's Devin with another fragrance review and today I'm going to be talking about Scent Journey. And I bought their discovery pack of four fragrances. Uh, let's see, there is Lido Life, there is uh, Cocktails and Catamarans, Siesta Sunset, and uh, I believe it's pronounced Grecian Grotto. So I've worn them a couple times and so I'll give them a, a review, I'll talk about them and let you know what I think. All right, so we're gonna talk about, the first one we're gonna talk about is a Lido Life. So I'll give it a spray here first. And so this fragrance to me um, is gonna be more of kind of like a, a margarita. It has a very zesty lime. Uh, let's see what the notes say. Uh, citrus, mint, and lime. Uh, and then let's see the scent transitions from a bright green opening toward a coconut, white floral, and ginger heart. And so I definitely get that that mint, lime, and citrus opening. Definitely, as I said, like a margarita. Um, for me personally, I do get the florals uh, on the dry down, but it really pretty much sticks with the, the citrus, mint, and lime throughout the, the entire fragrance. Really enjoy this. Very refreshing, nice, nice vacation fragrance. The next fragrance I'm going to be talking about is Cocktails and Catamarans. And that one you may have heard of because uh, it's kind of gone around the, the review videos. And this one smells a lot like uh, a pina colada. And let me tell you, it is accurate. This is just so good. I mean, if you're into pina coladas. Mm, you got the coconut. Let's see what the other notes you have here. It says blood orange, mandarin, green apple, uh, pina colada, melon, with a base of tonka bean, uh, marine notes. And I'll be honest with you, I don't, I don't particularly get the blood orange, the mandarin, the green apple, the opening notes, or the grapefruit. Maybe a little bit of the green apple I do get right now, um, but as a whole, it just smells like a pina colada. So if you know what that smells like, this is spot on. And kind of just like the, the Lido Life, um, the dry down really kind of sticks to what the initial smell is. And you don't really even get florals um, kind of in the dry down for this. So. If you like pina coladas, you're gonna get that throughout the whole fragrance. All right, the next one is uh, Siesta Sunset. And the notes you're gonna find with that one are Italian orange, uh, Calabrian bergamot, grapefruit, strawberry essence, um, middle coconut, orange blossom, and the base of vanilla musk cardamom. And so it says the fragrance opens with a sparkling combination of strawberry and almond, uh, and then a blend of grapefruit, orange, and bergamot to help lift the scent. So. And this one, I will say, it's definitely kind of a, a darker strawberry. Um, and really it, I would ultimately describe this as just like a very fresh um, bowl of fruit because the orange, the grapefruit, the strawberry all really kind of blend together um, to create this very kind of fruity concoction. And so, this is a little darker than um, the first two, but 
So I would say if you bring it on vacation, this might be more of a, a nighttime fragrance, whereas the other two are definitely more daytime. But this is another very refreshing fragrance um, that is smells great. <laughs> All right, the third fragrance is going to be a Grecian Grotto. So let's see. So this one um, says it opens up with a blend of rosemary, apple, and bergamot. Uh, heart consists of spicy warm blend of sweet tobacco, black, black tea, honey, and cantaloupe melon. So for me, this is probably the richest and the darkest of the four. And pretty much throughout the the whole the the opening and the dry down, I get kind of a a black tea, rich black tea, honey uh smell. And kind of took me a little while to appreciate it, but after uh, after a couple wears, I've really enjoyed this, kind of like knowing what it is and what to expect. So um, much like Siesta Sunset, I would say this is definitely kind of more of a nighttime vacation fragrance because it's so kind of rich and dark. Um, but I guess, you know, if that's your thing, you could wear it during daytime, but this is definitely still has... Uh, very kind of still fruity, but that honey black tea is is a nice kind of touch. So, so those are my thoughts on Scent Journey's four fragrances. Love them. Uh, can't wait to wear them more. Can't wait to wear them on a vacation. And uh, get a get a discovery pack and try them yourself. And let me know what you think. All right, guys. I'll see you later.